Greetings Gamers, hello YouTube, and welcome back. Uh, you are just in time to look at final teaming. Uh, this is Sinlar Gaming 101, I am Sinlar, and we are in the middle of Starbeast Meteor version Pokedex playthrough. But we have some Pokemon, um, I have added some TMs to the list, I have a TM, I'm holding on to Ice Beam, so I'm not gonna show off movesets entire- eh, maybe I will. I'll show off movesets, why not? But this is our final team that we're gonna go with. Uh, starting with Jelly Heli, Water Dark, with currently Rap Scald, Sludge Bomb, and Surf. Right now, it's the only member of my team that can learn Ice Beam, so I think I'm going to teach Jelly Heli Ice Beam. Um, we also have Majovic, which, whoops, I don't want to switch it. Actually, I do want to switch it. Uh, we'll switch it with Gigantes, but we have Majovic, which is currently a Psychic type. Running, Recover, Metronome, Confusion, and Psychic. I'm really hoping that that evolves soon. Uh, we do have Hamephalon, which I taught Cut. Um, I figured it would find more use in Cut than Chordatus would. Um, although I'm not entirely sure that that's true either. I also taught it Tri-Attack. Um, Tri-Attack, because it's normal, is based on physical attack and not special. And Hamephalon has... A, more need for the coverage, and B, a much higher physical attack. And so I taught it try attack um, and then strength and rock throw. For its typing, we do have Chordatus, which we had last time, which is ground flying. Uh, definitely needs to catch up in level. Hopefully it'll catch up in attack. Uh, fly, rock throw, both kept. And then earthquake, and I gave it shadow claw for a little bit of team coverage because ghost type is also physical in this generation. And then I actually chose to go with Gigantus, which is a fire grass type. Its stats are not very exciting, but then you have to look at its level. It's level 25. It's going to be slow, but it's got hit points out the wazoo for being only level 25, so I don't think speed is going to be an issue. It currently knows Growth Stomp, Mega Drain, and Body Slam. I'm really hoping to get rid of Stomp and Body Slam in favor of, like, fire-type moves. Would <laughs> be A fire-type move would be great. Um... Oh, wait a minute. Didn't I... I could have sworn. Maybe I didn't. I'm going to. I'm going to teach Dragon Claw to Gigantus. For now. This will give me a little bit more coverage um, against Dragon type. So will Ice Beam. But right now, like I said, Jelly Heli is the only one that can learn Ice Beam. Um, I'm going to keep growth for as long as possible. So forget Stomp and learn Dragon Claw. And we're moving on. Today's goal is Cinemar Gym. I do want to finish clearing the trainers between here and there. And get Gigantus a little bit of a few levels here. Um, and then get into the gym. Maybe get Cordatus some levels. Get Gigantus a few more levels would be even better. Uh, and we'll see from there. Uh, Gigantus is going to run from this Quimpail, and we're going to go to the dock of Fishers. You want to know if the fish are biting? No, no I don't, because one just bit me. That Quimpail bit me, and I ran from it. Sending out a K-Mac. Okay, level 30 K-Mac. Um... It's going to quad resist Mega Drain, so let's not leave this in. Best bet, actually, at this point, unfortunately, is Cordonas. Uh, the other bonus to this team, which I didn't mention, which I'm super excited about, I wanted to find five, and I found five. I found a five Pokemon team that I think is going to cover most... It actually did a really good job of covering most things straight off the bat, just off its base typings, um, defensively and offensively. I don't have anything that's going to be super, super duper weak to anything that I want it to fight against. Things like Cordatus is super duper weak to ice, but I'm not throwing Cordatus against ice types. Flying and ground types aren't good against ice types. That's Hamephalon and Gigantus. Um, it covers all of my bases. It should cover all of my bases. 
just in the base typings, and then I can just go for um, secondary moves that help me out however I need them to. So I'm super excited about that. I found my five-man team. I can use the Elite Four. Um, base red game puts the ace of Varric's team. It's not Varric, it's supposed to be blue, but the base of Varric's team is level 60... The ace of Varric's team is level 68, I believe. And so I want to go level 60 before I start training anything that is not remaining on the team. It's another slappy, so no, I'm not going to change Pokemon. Um, I want my team to be level 60 before I start training anything else. The reason I am doing that is because I don't want to spend a lot of time grinding in um so slappy, what am I doing? Focus similar. I don't want to spend a lot of time grinding in Victory Road. Uh I might spend a little bit of time grinding so that I can get the legendaries. I do need to find something that has sleep of some sort. Is, I think, the best. Uh, something with Sing would be perfect. But that's... That's for another day. I don't want to spend a bunch of time, though, grinding in Victory Road to bring my Pokemon up. And so, if I'm short level 60, I'll probably just go in and see how it goes. At least the first time. If I gotta grind up after that, I gotta grind up after that. But, for the first round, I can, I can go in and I can be like, oh yeah, this is easy money here. So that's the goal. Um, since I'm just getting double slapped in the face by fish. But with two gyms, Victory Road, and the Elite Four, and that's all we've got. Um, I don't want to spend a lot of time training up things that I'm not going to use. And missing out on levels and having needing to grind in Victory Road. So that's where we are with this. This Chompy is not going down. One more. But I think that puts Gigantus out of Mega Dream. Really don't want to go back. All right, Gigantis Chris level twenty six. Cool. All right, Charlie Holly surfs. What's wrong with me swimming? Uh, nothing's wrong with you swimming. But you have Pokemon, and I want to... Oh, that's what's wrong with you swimming. You're not a swimmer. <laughs> okay, then. Um, I should be able to resist everything that you can throw at me. Oh, I have one Mega Drain left. This should be super duper effective. Against the drunk Congo, so we'll get ourselves a good start. It's probably gonna try and rest. Oh, it doesn't rest. Bubble beam. That hurt a little bit. And I'm out of Mega Drains. That was a really cool animation for Dragon Claw. Which is really bonus because Dragon Claw did not exist in original red. That was the big problem with Dragonite, was that uh, not only was it a dragon flying type, 
and had a huge attack, but half of its stab was based on special, which it did not have. Oh, an Eradicane. Yes, I'm going to change Pokemon. This is where an electric type move would be really, really good, but I don't have one. Cordatus probably isn't going to do very well because it'll resist. It's going to resist Majovic as well. So let's go into Hamephalon. No, eh. Now let's go into Jelly Heli. I don't know that I like it intensely. But I don't know that I have much choice here. So, surf! Anyway, um, Gen 1 Dragon move pool, besides the f or problem with Dragonite, um, besides the fact, see this is why we need a fire move, besides the fact that Dragonite was a great physical attacker, and Dragon is special, uh, also had the added difficulty that there's only one dragon move in the entire game, and that's Dragon Breath, which deals fixed damage. And the point of all of that entire statement was that I think the added Dragon Claw uh, animation is awesome. Alright, we know that Slaymore doesn't really have the attack to be doing that. I don't necessarily want to take another one. I definitely don't want to take one of those. Although that's also special, isn't it? That's the one I really don't want to take. Oh! Oh! Okay, let's just finish this off with a Shadow Claw, although that was probably a bad idea. Kill it, kill it. No! And Aerial Ace takes me out. Rats. Alright. Majovic for the finish. Just because I need it to evolve. The downside here is that if Modvich doesn't really learn anything, I mean it could learn Dragon Claw. Probably would have been really useful. But if it doesn't learn Ice Beam, because it doesn't learn Thunder either. A studded inner tube. Yes. That I can get behind. Okay, uh, Hyper Potion, you. The sea cleanses your body and soul! I cleanse your Pokémon of their lives! Mutagen, okay. Cordatus would be really nice right because I'm already confused. Ouch. Go figure, I'm trying to finish this thing off and I just can't break past the confusion! Fortunately, that mutagen is totally relying on me killing myself in confusion. And a tighter maybe will I change Pokemon? Yes. Will it be Gigantis? Yes. I think it's level 30. 33. But Gigantis is not facing this. Straight out. Um, can't go into Cordatus. Majovic would be the preferred choice. Don't know that it's a wise one, but we're gonna make it anyway. Tighter maybe goes lovely Chris, which Oh! Oh! So maybe I'll train up a tighter maid for anything with lovely kiss would work. 
There was something I fought in the last episode that also had Lovely Kiss because it kept putting me to sleep and I kept being like, Arrgh. I just need a Lovely Kiss Pokemon. And we'll need it for all four. Things. So maybe I'll see about getting one out and training it up a little bit in between episodes. I don't have... the only thing in my team that I expect to evolve is Majovic, so... Ooh, it's got Sing as well. Makes Tighter Maid sound like a good one, but then I have to train it in episode because I don't have a Tighter Maid. I don't know, we'll see what we have. Do 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 do. Lurching, we run away again. Flying and poison are two excellent types to face a gigantus with. Do 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 do. Some more fishermen. We're gonna dock with them for the moment. Hey, don't scare away the fish! I do what I want. It's a pail. I forgot to heal Majovic. Clempale doesn't give me any XP either. Let's use Majovic's Recover for a couple turns. I don't think this Klimpale can hurt me, so... This will save the potions. It takes a little bit more time, but it saves the potions. So. And I think that was the best turn we're going to get, so Psychic. And a tussle. Will I change Pokemon? Yes. Go into Gigantus and then go back to Manjavic. Because Tussle will actually give me some good XP. Tussle is fighting type. Gigantus grows to 28, which is good. Doesn't mean as much unless it learns something. Sorry, I didn't mean it. I was just angry that I couldn't catch anything. I'll give you a hit. He's like, keep me company till I get a hit. I'll give you a hit. You ready for your hit? Here it comes! Boom! Hit! Oh, you want some more? You want me to do this again? Okay. I will absolutely do this again. Alright, 
600 XP each, and done with that fisherman. That burned some time. Yeah, it did. Oh, wait. I got a bite. Yay! I'm so happy for him. Like, genuinely, truly, they never get any sort of fun. This guy caught all his Pokemon at sea. All one of his Pokemon. It is a notion, though. Which is fire water, I believe. So rock would do amazing here. If I live long enough. Ouch, but no burn, that was the important one. Rock throw! Oh, I didn't take it out. Scald won't take me out, but if it burns me... That's gonna be bad. Okay, it didn't burn me. Rock throw, hit. Good. Notion out. Gigantis grows to level 29. Diver down. That's Hyper Potion. A Mephalon, just in case. Because I think this is the last one. And then we're going to go into the gym. And... The gym at... I had to think about that for a second. The gym at Cinnabar Island is famous for its... Wonderful trivia that allows you to entirely skip the trainers in the gym. Guess what we will not be doing today. And if you guessed anything other than the trivia, you're not paying enough attention. We are going to skip the trivia in the gym because we have way enough old Pokemon for where they need to be, and we need every morsel of XP we can possibly get. Will I change Pokemon? Yes. Change back into Gigantis to start, but as a Jelly Ellie, it is Water Poison, which A, means it's going to be really good against Gigantis, B, means we go back into Majovic and just one-shot it, unless it wraps me. I mean, I've been using this against plenty of stuff. Jelly Hill, Jell, uh, Jell I. I know what I want to say. Jell I learned rap before I ever got it as a Pokemon. I have been using that rap. I think that is the one move on Jell I that has not changed at all. It's the only move. That and Surf. Uh, but I've already fought this guy. Sunburnt to a crisp. So we're done. We just have to get back to Cinnabar Island. And go into the gym. We kept the secret key on us just to be safe. So now we're going to go into this gym. We're going to fight some peeps. Train up Homephalon and Cordatus. Or not Homephalon. Uh... Gigantis and Cordatus. Hemephalon is trained. I'm gonna swap in Cordatus to start. And we're just gonna talk to trainers. I heard Valid met all of the Holy Regents. I think based on the capitalization, the Holy Regents are the uh, legendary Pokemon of the region. The burglar sends out a Griffin. Cordatus is not so good against the Griffin. Oh, wait, Rock Throw. We should resist Flamethrower. Resist Flamethrower. And Rock Throw. For the win? No. Oh, bad. Quick attack. Hopefully, good. Rock Throw misses, though. Not helpful. Wing attack. Oh! Come on, Cordatus! Wing attack. Live! <sighs> Rats. 
Okay. Apparently this is gonna be a thing. So Gigantus comes out, Gigantus immediately comes back in and trade for Majovic. Just because I want Majovic to evolve, I feel like it evolves! But it doesn't evolve by stone, I've checked them a hundred different times. And we're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center! Woo! Because Cordatus gets nothing! Could have had 1300 XP. Instead has zero. Okay, there we go. Door open. Pokemon Center! Heal my Pokemon, please! <laughs> Do 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 do. All right, next. Do -do -do -do. You have you ever heard the story of Civic the Black Dragon? Uh, no. Sounds like I could get some good information about this universe here. Charcoal is a rock and steel type, so Earthquake is going to do wonders, especially if I can outspeed it. This will be quite effective. Four times super effective. Four levels won't mean anything. Four times super effective stab. Charconro, will I change Pokemon? No. Cordatus gets to continue training. Unless he misses. Conro goes for self-destruct, of course. Oh, but we eat that. Ate that for breakfast, man. And another charcoal. Let's hope this one doesn't blow up, but being under-evolved, it shouldn't do as much damage. And I believe self-destruct remained a normal type move? Question mark. Okay, okay, I'll tell you! Yes, tell me about Sivak, the Black Dragon. Sivak wanted to be free from entropy, so he betrayed the other three holy regions. They say he was so ashamed over what he had done that he hid away from them forever. Okay. Everybody's heard of the four holy regions. Okay, so the Mewtwo... whatever Mewtwo is. Also. Oh, I didn't heal Cordatus. That was a bad move. Um, let's go Earthquake because it's Stam. Do, do, do. Cool. Can glue it down. Cordatus up. I like it. An Embrane. Will I change Pokemon? No. This is the Fire Psychic. I think it's just fire to start. Okay. Psychic typing doesn't actually take away from this. And apparently I am way over leveled for this gym. And a cremate to finish out. Okay, this one might be able to hit me. Do, 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 do. But the nice thing about this gym is even even at level, I have so much that can take it on because I have Cordatus, ground type, I have Hemephalon, the rock type, and I have Jelly Helly, the water type. Why, Regents, help me! No. The Regents are going to be mine. Nobody really knows what the four Regents are other than gods! Pokemon Creator of World sounds like a scam to me. I saw an excellent uh, theory that people are just Pokemon. So we could be the ultimate expression of the evolution of Pokemon. I am not going to let Cordatus take this one on alone because he did way too high level for that. Uh, so Jelly Helly gets to come in and serve it to death. And prove that we really have no. should have no difficulty with the gym. 
Although the gym leader's levels are going to spike. But between Jelly Helly and Mephalon, I should be fine. Too hot to handle. Yeah, buddy. You know it. Door opens. And I can Hyper Potion. Because I keep forgetting to Hyper Potion Cordatus. Kind of a waste of the potion, but... Velid used to be an alchemist, a man of both science and magic. Ooh, that's a ghost, but whatever. Super Nerd wants to fight, sends out a Nor horse. I like it. Cordatus is not fighting it. But I'll let Hamephalon take this one, because it is fire dark. Body slam for the nothing because I'm a rock type, except I'm paralyzed. That's not helpful. Uh, let's go strength. It's got a better accuracy without losing stab. Fully paralyzed though, because that is my luck. Crunch doesn't work very well because I'm a fighting type, but I'm fully paralyzed because that's just how paralysis seems to work. Boom. One hit. We press on with a paralyzed Tamephalon. I will not be taking on Velin, Velid with a paralyzed Pokemon, but these trainers, I don't mind. I know Velid's secret, but I won't tell you unless you beat me! I know Velid's secret, too. I don't actually, but I'm gonna pretend. Richard Conroe at level 37, Cordatus at level 33, a quad effective earthquake should take this out. Please, 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 please! Because I don't need it blowing up in my face! Yes. There we go. Cordatus gets a bunch of XP, grows to level 34. About to use a Kangalit, will I change Pokemon? No, Kangalit comes out and takes another Earthquake to the face. This one is going to be a lot less effective because it's only double effective instead of four times. But it doesn't matter. Kangalit goes down. Cordatus gets XP. Yowza, too hot. Yeah, buddy. Alright, is that it? No, there's one more. Hell is real. Velid seen it. Okay, good to know. Maybe we'll get to visit. Sends out a notion. Okay, this could be bad for Cordatus. I'm gonna try it anyway. Fire spin. The Nui? Oh, it takes rap mechanics. That's weird. I don't think it did that in Gen 1, did it? Hmm. I don't remember that being a thing, that Fire Spin took rap mechanics. Maybe it did, and just nothing could have Fire Spin and consistent paralysis. Oh, hell. Yes, you've already said that. Every once in a while, Velid will wake up screaming about the things he saw ages ago. There isn't really anything any of us can do to help him. I wanted to know his secret. Velid was trying to find out how to make humans like us immortal. That's why he spent so much of his life looking for the four holy regions. And then this is Velid. So we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center to start. Alright, here we go! 
I'm gonna lead Cordatus, because he should lead... Well, hey, a new contestant! How did you like the quizzes? Didn't even take them. What's that? The leader of Cinnabar Gym. That's yours truly. Introducing the one, the only, whoosh, Villid! Hey, wanna see a magic trick? Well, it's not every day you see a pyromancer. So for my next act, I'll make your Pokemon disappear! <laughs> Nothing's gonna stop my blaze of glory. Not even burn heal. How about a rock, a bunch of dirt, and... Manser Velid wants to fight. He's got a verbatim at level 42 as the base. So yeah, levels jumped pretty hard here. But Cordatus Earthquakes were bait in. And that did not do much damage, so we'll go Earthquake again and Cordatus can get a whole bunch of XP off of her bait in. Alright, Mansor Villain is about to use a Bior guy, so will I change Pokemon? No, this is going to be a Ghost Fire type. Sweet Earthquake again. Ooh, Minimize. I like it. Smoke screen, going for the cheese. The downside to always running the cheese? Here's RNG. Cordatus wins again! And grows to level 35. Cordatus is quickly catching the team, which is good. Nor Horus, will I change Pokemon? No, I'll let Cordatus take this one. This one's a little bit scarier. He uses a Super Potion, which does no good because it happens first. I don't mind him wasting the Super Potion, though. Because Nor Horus is a little bit scarier, and the re there's the Super Potion. Uh, the reason Nor Horus is a little bit scarier, although if all it's going to get is Super Potions, maybe not so much. Um, it's fire dark, so it's not quad weak, it's not super weak, but it didn't matter. And a Gigantus! Okay, will I change Pokemon? Um, yes, actually yes, I'm gonna swap into Jelly Heli, this is gonna be a level 48, first of all, 47, it's got a ton of hit points. Oh, ah, Cordatus could fly. Whoops. We'll see what this Gigantus uses. Wood hammer. Okay, that's gonna hurt. High level Gigantus learns wood hammer, which deals recoil damage. Not opposed to that. We'll go slip up again. Just because we can. Crit, super effective, and we're done. Ha! I like your style, kid. You have earned the Volcano Badge and a bunch of money. Fwa ha 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 ha! The Volcano Badge heightens the special abilities of your Pokemon. Here, you can have this too. Receive TM38 with your Fire Blast. Teach it to Fire type Pokemon, Kangalit, or Cremate. Would be good bets. Uh, I'm going to choose neither. I'm going to immediately teach this. Its accuracy is going to be terrible, but I need the fire typing. On Gigantus! I like how my physical types can learn Fire Blast. Yes, we will delete Body Slam. Now, if we can find Flamethrower, definitely trade it out. But that's probably the only way that gets traded out. You know what? Why do that here? Let's fly to Viridian City. Because that's the next stop to make. And we will go and face the gym leader here. Which should dismantle Team Rocket. Fit. They hope to see me again. 
I do want Cordatus to not be up front. Let's swap in Gigantus, which is not going to be fantastic, but we're going to do it anyway. Not here. Meridian gym, Gym's Leader returned. Is it still ground? Gym of the making. Even I don't know Viridian Leader's identity. This will be the toughest of all the Gym Leaders. I heard that the trainers here like ground-type Pokemon. Good, that's the important part here. Uh, I want this item. It's Revive. That'll be useful. And then I want to face all the trainers. You look pretty harmless. Sure you're not lost? Yeah, I'm sure. Obviously, you've never learned to not judge a book by its cover. Sends out a Stolidus. Okay, that's not too bad. It's not a flying type yet, which is important. Uh, so we'll just go Mega Dream. He uses an X attack. That makes sense. I use Mega Dream from 10 levels behind and deal half its hit points. I like it. Another X attack on Stolidus, and we're done. Game, set, match. Oh! Not done! Okay. Dragon Claw for the finish. Earthquake. Two X attacks. For a neutral hit. From ten levels higher. Okay. Okay. Ah, and a waste of the X attacks. There we go. Gigantus grows to 30. Good, 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 good. Trying to learn Fire Punch! Huh. Yes, because accuracy? So it was a total waste of a TM, but, you know, there's there's those TMs. Um, will I change Pokemon? He's going into Cordatus, which is ground flying type. Uh, Gigantus does not have ice. I don't have anything that has ice. So I will swap. Let's swap into Modric and see... Oh, I shouldn't have straight swapped. I should have waited. Oh well. Too late now. Psychic. A hurricane coming my way! It's gonna hurt. Not as much as if it had been Gigantus. Ooh! Maybe I stand corrected. Munchvich gets a bunch of XP, grows to level 46. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yep, you're in the right place. Yeah, I am. Munchvich did not evolve. This makes me sad. Hyper Potion Gigantus, because the more it can take on, the better. Hyperpotion Modjevich, because the more it can take on, the more likely I am to see an evolution. And next. Roar! I'm working myself into a rage! Okay. Not sure why, but whatever. Robbie is a dragon fighting type. Dragon Claw. Okay, that hurt, that hurt. That did not hurt as much as I wanted it to. Thunder Punch will resist though, so that's not a big deal. Yeah, Thunder Punch me again. I love it. Love it. Eat those all day for breakfast. Take it out. No! Thunder Punch. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Gigantus goes down. Ah! Gigantus lived. And the Luzonin. Will I change Pokemon? No. Yes. <laughs> but this time I'm gonna do it right. Gigantus is gonna get some of the XP. Luzonin goes for Slam. 
fly. This will be neutral. It takes an X attack. Not a bad timing. Not. not very effective. Slam, fly again. And that should be the end of it. Boom. Done. And just Cordas both get a little XP. And the black belt is donezo. And we use another hyper potion. <sighs> Alright. Oh, not quite what I wanted, but whatever. Pokemon and I, we make wonderful music together. Excellent. What does the sound of your defeat? Sends out a Kara Oaken. Okay. Kara Oaken's not ground, it's rock. Um. We'll go into Jelly Holly. Just to get it done and over with. Oh, and in case Kara Oaken goes for self destruct. See, I always love the AI. It's like, I have self-destruct. Let me blow up in your face and deal massive damage, even though this is my only Pokemon. And I now lose the fight. And I didn't even do anything. <laughs> yeah, I'm in perfect harmony. It's hard to not be in perfect harmony the way you play, dude. Sends out a cream mate, so we'll send out Cordatus and send out an earthquake just because we can. I do like that there's a little variation in the gems. Uh, that they're not strict to type. Oh, cream mate might have hypnosis. Cream mate wouldn't be a bad one to put on for that. Although hypnosis sucks. I don't know, we'll have to see if cremate still knows if my cremate knows hypnosis. If it doesn't, I might just not. But we'll see. Gigantus grows to 31, Cordatus does not grow. Send out Norhorse will I change Pokemon. Yes! Will it be Gigantus? Yes! Will I be immediately swapping out into something else? Yes! Question is what? Yes, it has to be Hemephalon. Jelly Heli and Cordatus both need potions before I send them back out of the swap. Uh, and Modrifish would be weak. We'll use strength, we'll resist that flamethrower until we take the burn. That's not particularly helpful here. Enough one is hurt by its burn. But we go again. We resist quick attack, which is good. Strength. And more horse down. Gigantus gets 800, and the floor gets 800. And we move on with life. Ah! Officer down! Officer down! Yeah, that's a good way to stay under cover. I swear, I've seen the leader before. I've seen the leader before, too. It's okay. I get it. I understand. Should have used potions, but that's okay. I'm the Karate King, your fate rests with me. See, this is, you're supposed to go through, so you're supposed to go through the puzzle, right? You're supposed to go through all the spinning tiles and whatever. The great thing about this gym is that you don't actually have to do them. You just beat this guy, leave the gym, come back, and he resets back to that upper spot, and you just boop, right by him and done. Fantastic. Um, let's go Dragon Claw. It won't be resisted. Rock Throw is going to be neutral from a Chromag. That's not bad. Poison and change Pokemon. No. I'm taking a risk here. Mega Drain. 
slam. Live, 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 live. Yes. Mega Drain should deal quite a bit of damage. Not great, great, but great enough. And it goes for the Meditate, which means its attack goes up, and it's going to hurt if it hits me again. Oh, and I was going to be like, oh, but it's dead! No, it's not. And it goes Stab. Okay. Back down into the red. Hmm. just goes to 32. A what? Night Flight. Oh, is this Gerber? I feel like this has to be Gerber. Um, let's go Majovic. Your drill pick don't do garbage to me. Except it kind of did. I need to run potions again. And then I need to fly back to Cinnabar Island and buy more, apparently. XP all around, yay. Uh, yeah. Pokemon League, you don't get cocky. I beat your butt. All right, Gigantis. Mephalon's the only one that doesn't really need a potion right now. I do have at least one more trainer to take on, so this isn't totally worthless. Maybe a little bit, but not totally. But Hamephalon would be pointless. So I'm not going to do that. Let's do this. Go this way. Oh, that didn't do it. So how do I get over there? I gotta go around and I gotta face that guy. So the bonus is we have two more fights to do. Downside is I have to do them this way. The sound of whip crack is the sound of a sonic boom. If this guy doesn't use sonic boom, I'm going to be disappointed. Sends out a Volturnus. Oh, I didn't see what that other... Although I'd be willing to bet it's a Volturnus. That would be... That would make sense. Volturnus isn't ground... Oh, that's right. Jim's very... Slash. Crit. Try out Fire Punch. Goes for Mock Punch, which will hurt a little bit. Fire Punch again. Metal Claw? I should resist that, because Fire. And we're done. Whiplash! Yeah, buddy. Alright, Pokedex. Uh, no. Because we're now at 141 scenes. We saw something else. Which is cool. But where? What are you? Good. Night flight must be Gerbert's thing. Okay. Uh, potion for Gigantis so that it can continue to train. It's making good progress. Both of them are. Which is nice. Oh, we have another guy to face. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Then once I'm done, this should be all I need. Karate is the ultimate form of martial arts. Maybe. Do 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 do. Okay, we're gonna go risky. Fighting steel. That hurts. 
crit. Hurts more. Fire punch does that. Jump kick! We're dead! Live? Nope. Get Cordalis and XP here. Low kick does nothing because I'm a flying type dude. Oh, but that means she gets doesn't give anything for the next one either. That's okay. Let's put Cordalis up front. Oops. Cordata stakes some good resistance, and by resistance I mean immunity because it flies. Viridian Gym was closed for a long time, but now it's going to be Team Rocket's new headquarters! Sends out a Warnado. Okay. Cordata's not so great against this thing. Not terrible. Spike cannon, I should not resist. Ground type doesn't. Fire resists steel. Ground type does not resist steel. I remember that. Ah, rock throw again. Which would be neutral damage. Not a lot of damage going on there. Shadow call. More damage? No. We're swapping out. Okay, um, let's go Jelly Holly. Kinda wish I had Gigantus right now because Fire Punch would be fantastic. But we're gonna have to settle for Surf. There we go. That's more like it. Radicane. I'm gonna swap in Cordatus to get the XP, but then. Oh, there's no running from a trainer battle. Uh, Jelly Heli to actually do the fighting. Thunder, that would have hurt. Done. Cool. I was beaten. Yes, you were beaten. You can go on the Pokemon League only by defeating our gym leader. Well, then I guess it's time to go beat the gym leader, isn't it? First, we're gonna heal, so we can take the shortcut. Do 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 do. How do you do? Heal Pokemon back to perfect health. Heal! <laughs> do, 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 do. And here we go. Nope, I have to go around the long way. Which is lame. Alright, up here, over here. Here and victory is mine. And we are here. We have made it. Deep breaths. And in we go. Oh, Sinlar once again, our pals cross. This is quite fortuitous for me, actually. I planned to hunt you down and make an example of you, but you came to me instead. No longer will I suffer the indignity of having been defeated by a mere child. After this day, the world will tremble in fear when it hears my name. Lucian! It's Lucian. Nobody could have seen that coming. Oh wait, I saw that coming. A Drunkongo, level 45. My Gigantus, if it lives this move. Hey, this should do some good damage. Four times effective. Come on, do something dumb. 
That wasn't dumb. Okay. It didn't crit this time, though, which was huge! Oh, but it lives! What is... Gigantus! Why do you... And now he guard specs. You couldn't do that last turn? Ah. Gigantus grows to 33, which is good. A Mega Sand. Mega Sand is the psychic type, I think. Will I change Pokemon? No. Mega Drain. He goes for Sand Attack. Not a bad gig, but it gives me my, my hit points back. Which is not something you want to do. For Gigantus. Because guess what? Gigantus has a ton of... Dude. Stop with the cheese! Okay, I have three left. <sighs> I said Psychic, so let's go Jelly Heli. Because I don't mind Jelly Heli burning all of his... Surfs and Scalds. On this thing. I do mind. Gigantus burning all of his Mega Drains. We're gonna need those. Gigantus and Jelly Heli. Jelly Heli grows to 47, which is good. Good, 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 good. Cracture. Will I change Pokemon? Yes. We're just gonna go straight into Cordatus for this one. Because it is steel. And because I don't need to be splitting my 230s like that. Spike Cannon will hit as normal. Crit? Oh, that's bad. If he pulls five... Three... Four... Come on... No! Cordata Stone. I know there's no will to fight. Alright. Here and we're gonna go here. Drill pack, not a bad call. Uh, strength back. Sending out a Hemethalon while I change Pokemon? Yes. I'm gonna let Gigantus run the risk here. If it gets attacked hard, that may be GG's. If Hemethalon misses, I can start pulling some hit points back. Rock Throw should be neutral. But I have to get a miss here. Yeah, like that. Kill it. No! Why do you do this to me? Guard spec. Why? Oh, I've got no health. What's guard spec? What are you hoping to do with that? See, that's that's the kind of thing that somebody who doesn't know what guard spec is for. Predatox? <sighs> I wish I had. I do have. It's a risky play. Level 50 Predatox. It's a really risky play. But I have a revive. And I'm only doing it for the XP. Earthquake should take out Gigantus. Or not. Okay. Fire Punch. Guard spec, because that's smart. Fire Punch again. Should have swapped into the Earthquake, because that would have been FANTASTIC! Uh, Gigantus Faint, so we'll go Cordonis. Probably should have a potion on it, but I didn't. 
No, I earthquake it back. Sludge probably kills me from 14 levels up. Ooh, it doesn't! Resistance for the win! Come on. Almost. So close. Sludge bomb, I still resist it. Oh, yes! It's my time to take that sliver of red. Cordatus gains 2,000 XP, and that is how we roll. And yet, yet again you win very well, you may have the Earth Badge. He totally did not want to hand that to me. The Earth Badge makes Pokemon of any level obey. With it, you may enter the Pokemon League. Consider it my parting gift to you, Sinlar. TM27, which is Fissure. It'll take out Pokemon with just one hit. It, I made it when I ran the gym here too long ago. My time in this region is over. I will abandon this place and begin again elsewhere. Should our paths cross again, I look forward to fighting you. Farewell. And so Team Rocket is dismantled. As per usual. And that brings us to the end of an age. Uh, thank you for watching. I'm going to end the episode here. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, subscribe, comment. This game has been awesome. Um, I'm liking the, the tie-ins. I'm liking the new stuff. Lucian was awesome. Loved him. Um, we have eight badges. It's time for Victory Road. I'm so excited for this. Yes! My team is vastly underleveled. I might do a little bit of searching and see if something I have is close. I might be able to put some stuff to sleep. And then just go save scum my way to legendaries. I might wait. I don't know. It's so hard to decide. But you get to find out in the next episode. Until then, enjoy your gaming. Goodbye.